Seats in the house. A piece of the plane smashed into our kitchen. You're gonna be a game to remember. Johnny Silverhand, basketball fan. That's new. You know what I mean. He always said Another game starting. One where your head's the fucking ball. Thought the same thing. Something nasty's brewing. Fucking storms, what's brewing? Don't let the sunshine fool you. You're all against seasoned players, whereas you just stumbled onto the court. These are trained sociopaths. Pretend to be your friends while they fucking ain't. So go out and play. Just don't get played. Just come out and say it. You don't trust Myers. No, the type is all. Politicians. Worse, armed forces. Saying no to high-ranking cunts like putting your mouth over the barrel of their gun. Get shitty fast if you try to run. Take it from a deserter. Never told me about that. Nothing to be proud of. Tore out that chapter. Crumpled it, swallowed it. Our sitch hairballed it back up. One thing I did learn, caked in blood and mud. What was that? After every carrot comes the stick. Allow me to illustrate. Every grunt gets a rifle, flak jacket, and a bunch of promises. Comes a time you're out of ammo, Kevlar's tattered cardboard. And what's left of the promises? Fuck all, I'm guessing. Exactly. And that's when they reach for the stick they call values. Getting shelled in your dugout, chooms are taking refreshing phosphorus showers, and some officers ranting about loyalty and duty. The moment you stop shitting carrots and they wave the value stick, fucking run, rabbit. Run. I think you're forgetting something. I never took that oath. And rightly fucking so. It's <clears throat> bad enough we're on their payroll. I'll keep one foot out the door, okay? Gonna hold you to that. <laughs> Don't turn around. Eyes on the court. <laughs> Hands, what you holding? <laughs> Johnny, who the hell's breathing down my neck? How the fuck should I know? Only see what you see. I see you holding something. Show me. Like to know who I'm talking to. Don't lie, Virtual. You know who I am. Now, hands, show me. Got this token? Mean anything to you? I need to make sure. Keeps his cards close, this one. Who sent you? Don't know you, don't work for you, so you can fuck off with the interrogation bullshit. Interrogation? We're just talking. Keep it cool, V. Let me ask you again. Who sent you? Rosalind. I don't know any Rosalind. And neither do you. Got a pro spy here, V. Is she safe? Last time I saw her, she was. Can only hope that's still the case. Right. Right. Were you followed? Did you even bother to check? <laughs> Don't know. Wasn't looking for a tail. Well, we get one point for being candid. Had a girl. Black Thornton Merrimack, in the street. Three minutes, front seat. We better leave separately. Don't want anyone to get suspicious. You first. Don't want to be caught holding hands? Reed? Slippery motherfucker. <laughs> Fucking wacko. Like him already. Let's scoot. Hey, 
You see that guy I was talking to a millisecond ago? Big guy? Coat looking like he's planning on flashing some kids, huh? Hey, shut it or get lost. With the right guns installed, man, a freaking dunk ain't even hard. Gave me some damn little changes. Dunno, man. The fuck Hansen got against the plane? Had a bad day. Man, shoot that shit down. Black Thornton. Hey, look at this album. Apologies for the precautions. I only ever rest so much. Sometimes it's just safer to shove the barrel of a Malorian between a Troon's ribs, even if he is on your side. It's nothing personal. No hard feelings, I hope. Security measures, precautions. Thought the token would have done the job. Could be fake. Simply counterfeit. Counterfeiting a person is a lot harder. You're not in the biz, V. Our biz. Oh, what gave me away? You got into a stranger's car. You're lucky I am who I claim to be. I combed FIA data for info about you. Interesting profile. Snowman. Back at clan. No longer extent. Now a freelance murder. To make things more interesting, FIA you received a commission last night. One thing eludes me. What drove you to get entangled in this mess? Songbird hired me. Know her? Show me. Something up? We used to work together. I thought I heard the last about her, but... That girl's a magnet for trouble. Right. It's time we paid our friend in distress a visit. Address, please. Just... FYI... Not so sure you're gonna like it. Try me. Abandoned building on Crest Street, 8th floor. Damn straight, I don't like it. You left her alone in Dogtown? Was I supposed to drag her along while cruising around? Actually... Look, place seemed plenty safe to me. Safe? The derelict building in Dogtown. Just listen to how that sounds. Hold up. I need to take this. Why are you calling me on my day off? Last I heard, you're the manager. Ask Bob, he owes me a favor anyway. Yeah, well, tough nuts. You'd have to manage without me. Boss, man. I work the door at a club. Selection, you know, bouncing. FIA special agent. Bouncing away time in a club. The job attracts ex-cops and commandos, too. I know a few. They're a tough bunch. Trouble. Easy to blend in with over beers. This is not how I imagine spending my day off. Saving the president? Great action BD shit right there, am I right? Yeah, sure, I guess so. Does my eyes still smoke? Had a ciggy on the balcony this morning. Why are you ask? When things start to spiral out of control, She's likely to light up. It's high time we help her out. Interesting. 
Let's go. So this is eighth floor. Yeah. Lead the way. Honestly, this is not inspiring confidence. Relax, she ain't alone. Made some new tunes. Locals. Introductions were a little dicey, but she turned on the charm. Probably has her Dogtown campaign staff by now. This keeps getting worse and worse. Anyone that tried to extract her forcibly, this whole level would be in shambles. No way she would have gone quietly. Take point. Come on, open it. Open up. It's me. Yeah, yeah, coming. Don't move. Much. Fuck's sake. Again? Where is she? That's enough, gentlemen. Put your tools away, gents. Compare length and girth when I'm not around. You the boss. Are you sure? Look around. Positive. Hmm. You remembered my number. Some numbers you never forget. Never with me, Rosalind. You never intended to call that line. Well, I found myself in Night City with a bounty on my head. So it seemed the right moment to reach out, have a tete-a-tete, -tete, reset an old friendship. I'd offer to sit down and chat over coffee, but the clock's ticking. I need to arrange a passage for you to Washington. No, Reed. We need to talk first, all three of us. Come on, we should talk in private. The President, a merc, and a special agent walk into the Oval Office. Question is, where do I fit into this joke? You've seen the news. Uh huh. Hansen's spin work never fails to amuse him. He's not acting purely on his own initiative. Someone from our camp's propping him up. So, a uh, cast of hawks squawking for war. For some, the war never ended. This shit runs deeper, Reed. I wasn't alone on that flight. I heard so me was on board. Where is she now? V was the last person to talk to her. Most likely scenario, got caught in some ice on the combat bot when she hacked it. One little mishack happens even to the best, but no way to know for sure. Mm-hmm. Unfortunately, we need hard evidence, not speculation. Reed, I needn't remind you what this means for the NUS's national security. Besides, she's your prodigy, Saul. You taught her all your tricks. Hell, even recruited her. She and V have a unique... bond. It's a lead. Our only one for now. You two have to find her. Together. I already died for the cause once. Not enough? What do you mean you died already? What has my eyes told you about me? Said you'd let an intelligence cell here. Went into hibernation at war's end. So she omitted the fact that Arisaka tried to smoke me. Whoa, what? <laughs> and that I ended up in intensive care with three bullet holes. That six months had passed before I could take a shit on my own. Might have slipped her mind. Convenient. Well, now you know. 
Let me get this straight. You abandon Reed and NC. Leave him for dead, and now expect him to jump right back into shit? Newsflash, Madam President. Got a hell of a debt to pay. You're right. I'm sorry, Reed. For those seven years. Is that enough? To get us a fresh start? I'm here. I'll help. But I'm doing it for Somi. And my country. Call me naive if you like. As for you, V. You said in the car a songbird hired you. Correct? I don't know how much he's paying. But you better ask yourself. Is it worth it? Something's more important than Eddie's, Reed. That, we agree on. We all got our reasons. Mine's even got a name. The Relic. If I don't find so me, I'm literally a dead woman. Seems we're all on the same page now, V. Which means we can help each other, too. Gotta wait and see, won't we? If we want to find Somi, we gotta dig deep. I mean, actual reconnaissance. No stone unturned. We need contacts, informers not afraid to sing, who might see something in it for themselves. You'll need to earn their trust. Rest easy. Can be real persuasive when I need to be. Zeal's good, but don't wreak havoc. Not too much, not yet. I need to arrange a safe passage to Washington for my use. Expect my call soon, V. Thanks. For everything. Buy me a nice dinner sometime. <laughs> you do this often? Invite presidents out on dates? Often enough. Okay. Dinner it'll be. Just gotta survive till then. All right, I need to make some calls. All good, Jacob? Doggone fairy tale, V. This Rosalind chick, piece of work if I ever seen one. Thinking we might have had a moment. Shame she ain't finna stay longer. Mm. So what's the future hold in store for JNT? Two options. We die in Dogtown, or we hit the road, scoot far, far out of here. I guess it comes down to our dear Madam Prez. Will she keep her word? You'll have to excuse my friend. He's sometimes excitable. Right. You ought to teach him about the value of initial impressions. At least his kind goes guns blazing. I mean, screw those stab you in the Baxters. Gotta evac soon. Watch yourself out Nah, there, the world better watch out for Jacob. <laughs> Just remember to knock before you enter shady looking dicks. See, if I came knocking last night, I'd have missed the chance to meet my babe Rosna. And you, I suppose. <sighs> That's life for you, V. There's a lesson in all this, don't you think? Gonna boost soon. Keep an eye on Jay, will ya? One shitty nanny I'd make. Hey, keep it real, V. Will do.
Come on! Uh. Uh. 